Hello, beautiful, gorgeous people. I have a very exciting video today. I'm going to do a first impressions on a new product that I just got. It's the Sephora eyeshadow stick. It's called Colorful Shadow Stick and Liner Waterproof Formula. I was really looking for a nice eyeshadow that you can really quickly apply to your eyes and like a, like a one and done shadow and I heard that Sephora makes pretty nice eyeshadow sticks. So I want to test it out and see if it's true. I thought this shade was really, really pretty. This shade is called Truffle Shimmer, number 11. And I really just want to show you guys how it looks. I swatched this on my hand. I just couldn't resist it. I had to see and it was so gorgeous. So I just really want to see how it is on my eyes. I'm going to show you how it looks on my hand first. It's just such a beautiful brownish grayish color. I think it would look so pretty on the eyes. The first thoughts that I have when I swatch this on my hand is that it's super creamy. So I already have some makeup on. I have my base on and I think I'm going to go for a nice smoky look today. I'm really excited to use this. It's waterproof so I really hope that it lives up to this claim uh, because my eyelids get extremely oily and a lot of things just don't really stay on for long. Now I want to talk about this product a little. This has 0.4 ounces in it. It does look like a pretty chunky pencil. Looks like there's a lot of product. If I twist it up, you can see that there's a good amount of product in it. I don't want to twist it up too much so it doesn't break, but looks pretty good amount of product in there. So as it says on here, this works as just an eyeshadow, like an all over eyeshadow, but also as a liner. So you can really do beautiful liner and line your lash line with it. And I think it would look really pretty. The first thing I'm going to do to really give this a fair shot is I'm going to apply my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. I usually always apply eyeshadow primer if I do my eyes. I'm going to apply the primer with my fingers. I'm gonna give it two seconds just to dry up and then we will go in with the shadow. Okay, that's pretty crazy. I was trying to wipe down the shadow and as I'm wiping this, it really doesn't move anywhere. Look at that. There is a little bit of product on the napkin. I don't know if you can see. Just a little bit, but this is still on and it doesn't really move. Let's see if I apply some water. Okay, so we have a wet napkin and this still doesn't go anywhere. Okay, it came off pretty easily with my makeup remover, so that's a good sign. I'm very happy that it doesn't smudge when I touch it or when I try to wipe it off. That's a really, really good sign. And my eyeshadow primer is dry now, so I can go ahead and apply the shadow stick. I'm going to get you guys just a little bit closer so you can really see what I'm gonna be doing. I'm going to apply this to my whole lid and then just blend out the edges so it looks diffused and then we'll see what I'm gonna do from there. So let's see. Okay. I'm trying to get it as close as I can to my lash line and I'm going to apply this all over my lid. I'm not gonna be too precise because I am blending out the edges very soon. Okay, so first of all, this is not blended but I really wanna show you. Let's do the other eye now. I love how easy it is to create a shape with this. Obviously, as you're going to be using this, the shape of the pencil is going to decay, I guess. So it's good that you have a little sharpener so you can always readjust the shape. I think this is so cute. It does look a little bit crazy because I have no other eye makeup and I'm going to just blend this out now. Because it is waterproof, I sh probably should have went in way faster with the blending, but let's just see. So I'm just going to be slightly blending the edges. Yeah, so this is not budging much. It is basically in place now. So yeah, first thoughts now as I'm blending it is do not wait with this. Just blend it out as soon as you can. Um, probably do one eye first and blend it out and then do the other eye and blend it out. I'm going to use just a little bit more because I think I can make it just a bit more opaque in the middle. And now I learned my lesson. So I'm going to blend out the edges much quicker. Oh yeah. 
Okay, this would look so pretty as a liner and it will also stay in place all day. So that is great. This formula is just literally no budge formula. It's just insane. I'm going to just clean up a little bit over here to help this look a little bit cleaner but i s just love the color it's so beautiful i think to kind of blend it into the rest of my eye i'm going to apply this on the lower lash line you gotta work really quickly because i applied this right now and i blend it out immediately after i apply this and it blends out beautifully oh my god so gorgeous i don't think i want really anything other than that, on my eyes, I really want to see how it looks with just mascara. So let me apply mascara quickly and then I will show you how it looks done. Okay, this is how it looks with mascara. I think this is so sexy and just gorgeous. I think for daytime, it's definitely beautiful to use this as a winged liner and maybe smoke it out. But all over the lid, it's just so gorgeous. Absolutely love this shadow. I'm probably going to get a few more shades from this exact liner stick. This is just amazing. They had a few other pretty, pretty, pretty shades and I was really debating. I think they have like a nice copper tone, so I might get that too. But this is just so beautiful. It brings such a pop to the eyes. I think this will also wear beautifully throughout the day just because it is so waterproof. Really nothing can move this besides literal makeup remover. And literally the only thing I have on my eyes is the stick and mascara. I bet you could do so many beautiful looks with this stick even if you apply other shadows or do like a nice little black wing with this it would tie the look even more together but yeah i'm super super happy it's so beautiful okay i think we're done here i mean i'm just obsessed but nothing else to say besides obsessed 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 yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this first impression i will link the product down below so you can find it easily make sure to like this video if you liked my first impression also subscribe to my channel to see more videos just like this one comment down below what other products from sephora you want me to try i'm willing to get anything and try it honestly so just comment down below if there's anything else you want me to get and try before you do so that you could maybe save some money. Stay tuned and I'll see you guys in my next video.